Hello and welcome back to Zagreb in Croatia for the second run of slalom number six on the women's alpine ski racing tour. So Hans Lottier knows this track well. She will know, Ed, that she needs a big second run to try and put the pressure on Schifrin. Here in 2013, she earned a second place podium behind Schifrin. Now she can reverse that finish. 155.18, mission accomplished for Frida Hansdotter of Sweden. And there are just four skiers left to go. Wendy Holdener now has the chance to race ahead of Hansdotter. Holdener, nice and strong through the rutted turns at the top section and the first racer to find time on that upper part of the challenge. Although her best finish in Zagreb has been 15th, a pair of second place podiums this season offer hope that this night could be different. Wendy Holder and half a second ahead of Frieda Hansdotter is a beautiful ski from Wendy Holder. Holdner has surpassed Hans' daughter. Now, can she hold off Michaela Schifrin? That question will be answered by the best in the world, enjoying a season for the ages. As Schifrin settles into the rhythm, looks ahead, a little anxious on a couple of the turns. Putting the rocky start behind her, she recovers, finds her flow, and begins to showcase her brilliance on the slope. Dominance follows. She's coasting home, not wanting to take too many risks. Schifrin has got this jolly. Schifrin takes it by 1.59 seconds, and Schifrin wins in remarkable style. It's an emphatic victory. It was really challenging, and with like the snow coming down, it was snowing at the top, but raining at the bottom, um, and for sure there was a track. I don't know, it was just trying to be aggressive anyway, and sometimes it went a little bit too straight, but for the most part, I was kind of kept my speed going. I fought really hard, and it ended up working out quite well, so I'm psyched.